Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel. And of course, one of the things that I got today a lot in questioning is what's an NPU or neural processing unit? Where is it? How is it going to be on a PC? And so on. Of course, because we talk about Windows 12, that would be AI driven and all of the system, including the, the Windows shell itself, uh, they're talking about these, you know, 3D parallax looking uh, and adaptive wallpapers. It's pretty crazy. So right now, do we have NPUs and PCs? There are PCs that do have neural processing units already. Uh, new, the newest Mac computer line of uh, PCs is um, does have NPUs. They all have an integrated NPU. Some newer smartphones in their um, ARM chips do have certain types of NPUs, neural processing units. In terms of Windows PCs, there's not a lot out there. There are some that have a dedicated NPU chip, but they are scarce. And um, there's the uh, there's a couple of uh, PCs from the um, Surface line of Microsoft, but overall, the majority of the market is not um, is not you know does not have NPUs. So how an NPU will be? It will be on the motherboard. It's not an add-on. It's not something you would add to a PC, it comes on the motherboard like your CPU, GPU is on the motherboard for the most part. And it is often linked. Uh, here you see that the uh, newest AI PC here with Meteor Lake Intel chips actually integrate an NPU within all of it. Um, it's become pretty much um, uh, a, a, a thing now that you have a GPU or a graphics processor and a CPU pretty much embedded in the same uh, processor, uh, in the same die. So basically what happens is the NPU will be added there. There could be motherboards that have a separate NPU chip that is not linked to the CPU, but this will definitely be something that's on board the computer. Uh, what I expect with a lot of what's happening, and including the new ARM chip that's coming, the new powerful ARM chip that's coming, uh, the Snapdragon from uh, Qualcomm, uh, will actually have onboard NPU. So the ARM processor, uh, the new um, Snapdragon uh, X, is going to have NPUs, which means the ARM PCs will have the capability of what Windows will ask them in the form of neural processing and AI. And uh, more and more PCs probably in 2024 will be coming out with this, especially if Windows is hinting very, very uh, strongly towards an AI future in NPUs. Uh, there's uh, probably going to be a lot of manufacturers that will start manufacturing PCs with neural processing units. So why do we need an NPU? Well, it's the same thing as why do we need a GPU? A GPU or a graphics processor just you know says it all. It actually processes images, moving images, like in games and, and movies, videos that you see on your screen, it's dedicated to do that. So it leaves the CPU or the main processor alone. So that's why sometimes you can play a game. Notice that your processor, your CPU is almost unused, but the GPU is used at 100% because it's doing all the hard work. And because it's specialized in that, it actually does it better. It's the same thing for an NPU. It will process all the um, what is the neural computing that AI requests or wants to do uh, in a, a computer. So it will leave the CPU alone. And uh, there's a lot of things that it can do. They're talking about, like I said, 3D parallax wallpapers that adapt depending on how you move the mouse cursor and so on. Uh, they're talking about enhanced video games and videos in general because there will be neural processing or AI processing of the video signal. Uh, so basically everything will be even better. Uh, and uh, of course, kind of human-like, um, if you want, uh, features which uh, the NPU and the operating system will 
you know, know what you've done in the past. We'll be able to take requests and, and you'll be able to ask it a little bit like you would ask somebody that wants to search for a feature. I was talking in one of the videos, for example, with that new Windows, they're saying, if you've had a, a document that um, Bob sent you a month and a half ago, you don't remember the name, you don't remember, you know, you want, you need it, but you don't remember where you saved it, what's the name of it and anything. You can just ask the AI um, simply, what's the last document that Bob sent me? And it's just gonna say, oh, that's the one, and it's dated October 9th. And it's gonna actually tell you where that document you're searching for is. So it's it's gonna it's gonna be really really make PCs advance into a new level of computing, and will be much more powerful. And so I expect in you know late 2024 and mostly 2025 and forward, PCs will pr probably have, you know, an NPU will be there all the time on pretty much everything you purchase. Uh, like I said, Mac computers have them. Uh, a lot of smart smartphones today have them now. Um, so that means that, you know, only the PC on Windows are still behind, basically. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.